Hi, I'm Emily. Today I'm going to show you how to create pages in Library DXP 7.4. Library DXP has two types of pages, the default content pages and widget pages. The main distinction here is that content pages are built using page fragments and widgets, while widget pages use only widgets. We'll start by opening our site menu and navigating to Site Builder, Pages. We'll click the Add button on the right and select Public Page. Our main option, blank, is the content page. The widget page is listed here under Other. We'll select the blank content page. We're prompted to add a name and we'll call this page Welcome. Once we click Add, we can immediately start building our page. To add content to the page, click the Add symbol on the right to open the toolbar. We have two tabs here, Fragments and Widgets. We'll start by adding a banner fragment. We can use the search bar to find it. I want the banner center for this page, so I'll simply click and drag it onto the page. The nice thing about content pages is we can directly edit the fragments we add. For instance, I can select the banner title example and change the text to read, Welcome to Liferay. If I go back to our browser sidebar, I can also select the Styles tab to change the style of our fragment. I'll select the heading element, go under Styles, and change the font text color to black. I can also change the button text to say Learn More. And again, if I select this element, I can go to Styles and change the button size to large. Now, we'll go back to our toolbar to add a few more fragments. I'd like to add a row of cards just below our heading. To hold our cards, I can use the grid fragment. For this page, I want four cards. Under the General tab, I can increase the number of modules to four. I also have the option to change the size of each module by dragging the blue dot. Now I can add the cards to our grid. I'll go back to the Fragments tab, select Card, and simply drag it into each section of the grid. We won't worry about adding details to our cards now, but we can easily manage those components using the browser sidebar. The last thing I want to add is a Media Gallery widget. So I'll go back to the Fragments and Widgets toolbar, select the Widgets tab, and find the Media Gallery under Content Management. We won't worry about adding media to this. Now that we're done creating our page, we can hit Publish. By default, content pages exist as drafts until you publish them. And now we can see our content page has been added to the site. If we need to make any changes to the page, we can click the Edit or Configure icons up here at the top. Looking for more information on this topic or others? Check out our links in the description. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and hit the bell for notifications. Thanks for watching.